mind blowing, man. 10,000 years later, and it's still the number one seller. Ever since Egyptian Moss came out and been known here in the U.S., it has always been a top seller. Always. Always been a top seller. Always. Matter of fact, by the way, I want to throw this some information out there, by the way. Um, Tariq Nasheed, if you guys don't know who Tariq Nasheed is, Tariq Nasheed is the guy who's the owner of Hidden Colors, right? One, two, three, and four. Check those out, by the way. Very, very informative, very beneficial. But anyway, Tariq Nasheed, he has his own album out. The name of the album is actually called uh, Mink Sly Egyptian Must. That's the name of the album. Um, six years ago, I was selling oils in Detroit. I was riding my bike selling oils. Um, you know, the crate attached to the handlebar, handlebars. And you know what I mean? I was on the west side of Detroit. And a lady bought some oils for me, and this lady asked me one question. She said, you got Egyptian musk? I said, yeah, I do. And she bought it. And so she said, did you know that Queen Latifah was very fond of Egyptian musk? I said, no, I didn't know that. She said, yeah. She said, matter of fact, in one of her albums, there's a track that she was speaking very highly of Egyptian musk. She was, you know what I'm saying? In her song, she was, you know, she was mentioning Egyptian musk. And I said, oh, wow, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Matter of fact, you can take each and every celebrity, each and every celebrity, African-American, and I guarantee you that they know about Egyptian moss. I don't know anybody that don't like Egyptian moss. I know white people that buy Egyptian moss. I know a, a lot of Africans, a lot of black people, they buy Egyptian moss. I, listen, I have clients, young females and young guys as, as, as young as 14, 15 years old, 13 years old, 12 actually too. Come in action about Egyptian musk. Mid-aged women. Well, not, uh, well, 30s. Early 30s. Mid, mid 30s. Late 30s. Early 40s. Mid 40s. Late 40s. Senior citizens. Hey, man, listen. Everybody like Egyptian musk, man. I don't know how that perfume chemists do it. But. Wow. I don't know how I don't know how that perfume chemist do it. Whoever he was, man, or whoever she was, that person is a genius. That person is a genius. Now I will give you some very informative information. I will give you some very informative information. And this right here will actually show you how wise Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi was. How wise Prophet Muhammad was. There is a narration. There is a pro prophetic narration. Where Prophet Muhammad Sallallahu Alaihi was selling peace and blessings be upon him. He said. Wear musk. For it is the best of scents. Wear musk. For it is the best of scents. It is the best of fragrance. Prophet Muhammad, he said that. Prophet Muhammad, sallallahu alaihi was selling peace and blessings be upon him. He spoke very highly of musk. And he said musk is the best of fragrance. This show you how wise he was because how did he know that? How did he know that? And here it is. Egyptian musk is what? And what happened? And here it is. 2018 and is well known that Egyptian musk is the top seller in every single oil shop. Top seller. You feel what I'm saying? So, I mean, I just want to shed some light on that, man. I just been sitting here scratching my head thinking about like, wow, man. And I said, man, it showed you that, man, it's amazing what you find when you dig for stuff. I'm going to say that again. It's amazing what, what you will find when you actually dig for stuff. When you dig for stuff, man, you find gold. If you dig over, if you just dig for five or ten minutes, you ain't going to find the gold. You know what I'm saying? You probably find a couple precious rocks. You know what I'm saying? But when you dig and you dig and you dig for hours and you dig for days and you dig for weeks and you dig for months and you dig for years and you dig for decades and you dig for centuries, man... You come across some very, very valuable.